I'm talking about online language exchange with AI. Uh, AI revolution is a language revolution. The large language models um, is very effective. Uh, there are um, many, there are tremendous contents on AI platform, AI uh, contents generated by AI. The famous AI like uh, ChatGPT uh, are from LLMs, which means they give uh, learners uh, tremendous contents uh, on language exchange. Um, my experience for three months is uh, amazing about language exchange. I started language exchange for one month living in Vietnam. I've been uh, in Vietnam about now six years since 20. 17, uh, except COVID-19 uh, one year. And then and it means about six years, six uh, or five years. During the winter season. But I, didn't uh, decide to learn Vietnamese, just uh, I practiced communication, only express uh, to communicate uh, local people. That means uh, I learned a simple sentence and listen a little, but and we do 45 days without visa. I decided to uh, one month living in Vietnam during the winter season because uh, the winter season, I have no work and because of cold. Uh, at the times I have enough time. After decided, uh, leave one month in Vietnam is uh, my situation a little bit changed. So I start, I decided to learn Vietnamese, Vietnamese language change. At the time, uh, ChatGPT uh, was famous. So uh, I started language exchange using ChatGPT. Uh, also, uh, I met the language parents, language, uh, language parents from Hello Talk. The language parents who teach languages, languages as uh, native speakers, uh, native speakers are good teachers. And then even me also, I can teach Korean. I teach Korean and language parents teach Vietnamese. The concept of language parents is a very um, good uh, term and concept or mentor or mentee, it will be good.
To succeed. To succeed uh, in language exchange is the timetable. Setting time is key with uh, some language parents. Now I regularly regularly do language exchange with uh, with five learners. And while I have been doing language exchange, I make sure that online language exchange is one of the good courses to learn any language effectively with many benefits. So I'll show you um, 10 benefits. 10 benefits. Uh, there are other benefits, but what I think and here, and then uh, 10 benefits uh, will be uh, think about doing online language exchange with AI. First, saving time. You can save in time if you meet uh, language meet uh, language parents um, in your life, and then it's also effective. But you should go somewhere, or you're waiting some someone, and then talking, and go to direct uh, language exchange session uh, is very. Um, difficult and also the uh you need to do one hour language exchange or two hour language exchange uh, a little less of time but online language exchange if you have set up the timetable with basically about one lesson one session is about 40 40 minutes and then you don't have to use uh uh use a, more time just to open with Zoom and then give the link to the language parents and they join uh, automatically and then <clears throat> say hello to and you go directly with the contents like Google Documents with any topic, any session, building vocabulary. Then say hello to, say goodbye to your language parents. It's very simple. And then um, saving time is key. Even you are busy at work, after working or people working, and then you can start language exchange with one session about 45 sentence or 45 minutes, about 45 minutes. And then uh, if you teach uh, about uh, six times or a week uh, while you are um, do learn quickly and then 12 times uh, a week uh, is uh, I think it's enough time to learn any language quickly beyond the level with the AI content this one is a very benefit the beyond the level with the AI contents. Normally, and uh, when you meet uh, language partners, language parents, and then the same level is very important to communicate with each other. And also the, at least uh, without any contents like uh, online, Zoom or Google documents, and then without interface, uh, you should be uh, at least uh, you are higher than basic intermediate level to communicate each other, speaking and listening. And but uh, someone who starts uh, first time, even they don't know 
uh, alphabet or they cannot read it, words, no, no about any sentence, can do uh, language exchanging because then go step by step with the Google document and then you can get uh, some words or the basic sentence and then the like a lower play and then lead your own uh, language and words and sentence and then your language parents lead their own language and words and sentence and then cross and then help each other uh, by doing them and then you can improve improve and also uh, basically uh, after practicing you can go to step so also well when you have a timetable and you can meet at least two more three learners three um language parents uh, by by doing that and then you can meet uh, different levels. So, and then you can ask something or you can uh, get familiar with the different pronunciation and different information. So uh, the point is uh, online language exchange is uh, beyond the level. You can study with uh, any levels. You, you, when you may meet um, high level uh, learners, language parents, it, it will be good. But uh, when you meet, uh, now is they got a first step to learn uh, your language, uh, to mean Korean, it, it doesn't matter because I give you the, some words and I practice some words because uh, um, I, I should practice uh, uh, pronunciation. Even I, I know about uh, some expression in Tengue Vietnamese. I need to practice, practice, practice with the language parents. Even uh, they are beginners. They are novice in uh, Korean, but they are native speaker in Vietnamese. That is the point. So in the second benefit is beyond the level with AI contents. And then also building vocabulary is keyword. Uh, learning language is uh, uh, knowing vocabulary. Uh, to express or to talk or write some topic, at least you should know about more than um, 10,000 words. 10,000 words and then then you can use uh, uh, these words uh, to express uh, your idea. And then so building vocabulary is a better key point. The um, online language can make uh, easier uh, when every lesson you study with uh, your uh, language parents about 20 words and then cross-checking and then your language or the target language and then if you have one one um okay 500 500 uh, session time 500 means if you have two hours a day and it's about um one year one year and then one one year and uh, six months 1.5 years and get the reach the 10,000 words it possible at least uh, one year so you can get to the 10,000 words if you more adding 18 and um, time um, is also possible. So the building vocabulary is a very key point. But when you start building vocabulary and then you can also 
uh, get proper pronunciation and in, it will be effective practice. So uh, while you're learning the vocabulary, the normal method, common method, just memorizing vocabulary without the pronunciation. But when we study together, and then we help how to pronounce, and then we can listen and we can repeat, then and proper pronunciation and effective practice uh, with the sound. And also the online language exchange cooperation is possible with apps. I use Zoom and Google Documents. With Google Documents, you can share Google Documents with your language parents. And then by doing that and good interface, um, both of uh, learners to use a laptop and they can write together, they can cooperate, uh, they can uh, make content uh, half and half uh, together and then study together, teach it together. And then there are very effective way. And so, and cooperation is possible with AI or the apps and the high technology. And also information from language parents is very, very good. Not only learning languages, but also you get information about the culture, about to travel and then people. The more you are good at any language, and the better you express and the more you can get information, uh, speaking uh, or uh, expression uh, faster, and then you can uh, get more information. Also learning grammar. And then comparing two languages is very, very effective. For example, the Korean, Josa, very, very uh, frequently used. And the um, same as uh, Josa, we see the same grammar in Japanese, but other languages, no Josa. And then, so we can compare the why is Josa is important in Korean. And also by comparing Josa, uh, I can learn the grammar of Vietnamese. So in, in comparison, it makes possible a grammar easy. Also listening skill with good feedback. Now, now we practice with it pictures and then we see the pictures and then tell the one sentence each other and listen and get feedback um just any talk give you any topic tell a sentence but it takes time but with the pictures um it's saving time uh, People can uh, speak, uh, people can express quickly uh, with the pictures. Then uh, listening skill practices so, uh, with the pictures, very good. And also the little high level, uh, at least the intermediate can read it very well, understand very well, at least learn about any language for uh, one year or two years and then you can approach the, you can choose the main topics for each other that you are interested in. And then uh, building more vocabulary and also the, uh, the language exchange will be half your real life uh, to talk about main topic and you can become an expert language and uh, experts in the field of your um, 
life, your job and your academy, something, your hobby, and so helping each other with the main topic, with the um, high higher level. I think it's uh, intermediate. Two two people may intermediate. It will be possible. The higher intermediate, without any text, you can real language exchange, speaking, uh, just speaking, um, talking, and then at the same as you speak to your uh, friends. That is the goal to the online language exchange. And also the key, the past improvement, how fast, very fast. Uh, you can, while you are learning online language exchange with the language parents, uh, you can also learn uh, the other side and uh, for example, reading subtitle on YouTube videos, and then uh, reading um, many articles, and then those are uh, make um, you uh, improve uh, quickly. So past improvement uh, is uh, the benefits. Maybe. Um, you can ask uh, to ChatGPT uh, what are the in benefits um, with the online language exchange. Uh, they give report to you uh, good uh, source. And then also you can uh, refer uh, that report uh, from ChatGPT. Okay, join online language exchange.